Hello, in this video I would like to show you how to set up root tries with mass transit and RabbitMQ in .NET Core console applications. I have here created applications for sending messages and receiving messages that I have video on that. I'll leave it in the description box. And now I would like to configure the receive message application to retry failed message and consume failure. So I modified uh, message consumer to throw exception uh, after posting something to console. It will be always thrown exception so it will always fail and now in a configuration for receive point I will add retry policy which is just saying use message retry and this method has different um, constructors it um, can accept different uh, Arguments so I'll be saying their try policy will be interval, which I need to add. saying retry count one so we try retry once and interval will be like something thousand so for this interval I need to add um, green pipes using green pipes so this is my retry policies. There is there are different policies available. You can look at mass transit documentation for different policies supported non immediate intervals, exponential, incremental. And now in message consumer I will create the consumer for fault. So what it means, it means that once the regular consumer done with processing messages and it can't be consumed, the fault will be generated and it will be consumed by four consumer. So in four consumer you can do something with this message such as login or report or whatever dashboard so I, I'll just copy the regular consumer and I need to say message uh, fault consumer and a consumer interface but the type is fault message so
message here as well and let's just write console so default say in consuming fault and maybe just print exception exceptions are array we'll have one exception the first one and we'll get message from this exception and convert it to string not sure if I... Ah, it's already streamed, so don't need... I can just print it. So, let's save that. Let's try. Um, first, I have uh, RabbitMQ console open in this queue. I need to post something into it, so I have sent message set up as a startup project, I run that go look if something appears in the message in the queue so we have message posted, we can stop it and now We will set up receive message, set up start project, have um, breakpoint here, I'll set up breakpoint for the consumer or uh, fault consumer, and we will see how it works. So let's start it. So it goes to consumer once, it goes to consumer second time, and it says I received new message, but uh, retry warning retry. So it retries again. Since we set up retries once, it's again here, and after that. It didn't go to fault consumer because I forgot to register fault consumer. So let me stop it and go back to here. And we need to register the same way as we edit regular consumer. Okay, I just type. Save that. Need post again. So I have posted message again. Now we run 
receive message application. So in consumer, now I'm hit continue, it will be again there, again here, and now hit continue, and now it's in in fault consumer. The message with exception here. So we can step over, so go to the console, it says consuming falls, something bad happened. Oh, mistype it something. That's fine. But um, continue, and that's it. So the message still goes to error queue, but uh, we can do something with it before before it l ends up in the error queue. So this is how you will set up or tries in .NET Core application. And thanks for watching.